Greetings, folks. Welcome back. Rush Limbaugh, the Excellence in Broadcasting Network and the Limbaugh Institute for Advanced Conservative Studies. Open Line Friday. We try to take more of your calls on Open Line Friday than we do Monday through Thursday. UK Daily Mail. The... uh, it's, it's, it's an amazing story. Hospital staff, North Virginia, turning away sick people on a frigid Thursday morning because they can't determine whether their Obamacare insurance plans are in effect. Patients in a, in a close-in D.C. suburb who think they've signed up for new insurance plans are struggling to show that their December enrollments are in force and healthcare administrators aren't taking their word for it. They've got no proof. So people thought they were signing up for Obamacare. Somehow there's not an enrollment card or an ID card or a membership card or any kind of evidentiary proof that you are enrolled. But people went to, maybe some scammers in here probably are, but still some people thought they signed up for Obamacare, now showing up in the hospital at the ER, and they're being turned away. In place of quick service and painless billing, these Virginians are now facing the threat of sticker shock that comes with bills that they can't afford. They had no idea if my insurance was active or not, said a coughing Maria Galvez. Outside the Innova Healthplex facility uh, in the town of Springfield, she was leaving the building without getting a needed chest x-ray. People in there told me that since I didn't have an insurance card, I would be billed for the entire cost of the x-ray. She had her young daughter in tow. This isn't fair. You know, I signed up last week for Obamacare like I was supposed to. And, 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 and they're not treating me. Because she's got no proof. What a mess. What an absolute, total mess.